Hey everybody, it's Vicki Kinner, Independent Sensi Consultant, Sensi Director with Team Scented Style. And today I want to go over sampling and what size you feel is appropriate for your customers because it's all based on your budget and what you want, okay? So these are just um, to show you what you get out of the same amount of bars in different uh, molds, okay? So what I did was, I took five different bars and I took the bottom three cubes out of each one. So everything is the identical amount, okay? So I took this huge Scentsy mold, which I love this mold. I think it's beautiful. The classic curve is, well, classic and pretty. I just I love this mold. But you use a lot of wax. You don't have to, but you end up using a lot of wax. So um, when you're maybe new, you make the mistake of filling filling these all the way up. You see how, how much wax is going to go in there? Look how wide that is, How actually how deep that is, okay? So out of those three cubes of wax, you get three full samples. That's it. You're literally just giving people a whole thing of wax. Now, you may want to do that. It may be for your VIPs or a thank you bag that you're putting together. But think about this. If you're going to send this to someone for a sample and they're not even a customer or they rarely buy this from, from uh, buy stuff from you, or maybe they don't even like these scents, but this is the scent of the month and you want to send it to them. Well, they may smell this and throw it out, okay? So maybe you don't want to send such a large sample. Maybe you do. It's up to you. It's your, it depends on your budget, okay? No judging. I'm just doing the work for you so you can visually see how much wax you're using, okay? Now, for the same molds, but halfway, if you fill it up halfway, look at the difference, okay? Okay? So this is the halfway, you get five. So you get two extra. So if you still want to send a nice size sample, but you want a couple extras, you get two extra samples out of it, out of the same amount, three cubes, okay? So then I went, and this is my favorite mold. This is the mold that I always use. I like this classic curve, and I sometimes use it, but my favorite, I have three of these. This is from Michael's. And they're little gummy bears, and I think it's like the perfect size for my customers. So let me go ahead and show you how cute they turn out. So it's a little teddy bear, okay? Now, I got nine bears out of it, okay? So full size, three. Half size, five. Nine, nine bears, okay? Now, there is a size difference, and... You know, so it's it's up to you, all right? But now we have another amount here that I'm going to show you, another one. I use this small mold. For me, I think it's a little too small, but if it's in your budget to just do a little bit of wax, then this is a great option, okay? I got 25 of those, okay? These little gem size, 25, okay? So three, 25, same amount of wax, okay? So it's all what you want and what you're using it for or whatever. Now, when I'm mailing the scent and warmer of the month, I go with felt. And I usually get shapes, but this is about the size of a shape, okay? you can go smaller than this and get even more, okay? I do like like a one inch square about, okay? And I got 29 of these, okay? So for the same amount, like I said, for this, you get three. I got 29 samples, okay? Cost difference, big time. Another great thing about this is you can mail it with a stamp, this, once you mail this, this turns into a package. It's too wide, okay? So you're going to end up spending like 
$350, I think it is, like $340 something for a package, whereas this will cost you a stamp. So I just wanted to show you what you're spending, you know, so that you know how much actual wax you're using. Because we are here to make money, not waste money. But if you don't feel like it's a waste, if you feel like the, the way you're using your samples is appropriate for the size of the sample, you do you. This is your business. This is just to show you how much wax you are using, okay? So, yep, I have now five bars like this, but I like the scent, so I'm going to use it. Um, I'm not going to be selling these. I like these. So, anywho, you guys. So, that's it. I hope this helps. And um, let me know if you enjoyed this video. Let me know if this like helps to visually see the difference. And I hope you're having a great day and I'll talk to you later. Bye.